And um, after six months of serving, uh, my base was moved from Tel Aviv to the south. This was 2002. And I was asked to send planes to fuel planes that were going into Gaza, to bomb Gaza. Um, at that time, I didn't have the language to understand exactly what's happening. But as we returned to the base, I had my first panic attack and couldn't enter the base. And the next day, I had to come and stand trial. And I was grounded to the base for three weeks. And in those three weeks, I understand that I have to leave the army. And that, um, knowing at that moment, uh, made me want to take my life, because it was so against everything I was taught. Um, and that started a process that I will be in for the rest of my life, which is the undoing of that indoctrination and that brainwashing and the way that the Israeli identity has been merged with the Zionist identity. My message um, is, first of all, for everyone who can, to just find their heart and, and to liberate themselves from this identity that we call an Israeli identity. And there is no need for any one of us to serve in the IDF. The IDF should not exist. The state of Israel should not exist. We can be free without it. We can have a true connection to our heart without that identity.